Hello, everyone. And we're going to begin this week with the following. We're going to have an explicit lesson just to break the ice a little bit. And our focus is going to be about inquiring about the following prompts. We're going to have different prompts. As when you scroll down, you'll find the prompts. Okay. And I want you to inquire about them in order to come up with a different perspective. So this will reflect your thinking skills, your transfer skills. You're going to look at things you already know and um, explore in order to come up with different solutions. And this leads us to our second explicit lesson for the week, which is going to be social collaboration. You're going to be asked to make fair and equitable decisions based, based on these prompts. So group one will receive a scenario, access to education, impact on urban communities, and then you'll be asked to explore various aspects such as availability of schools, quality of education, and so on. Each and every group will receive a different scenario where you are going to look at them very carefully and come up with fair and equitable decisions in order to solve the issues. Okay? And we're going to wrap up with the, the week with a, let's say, more, like a project. You're going to create something very similar to this. It, this is called the Diamond Nine of Solutions. So you're going to create a solution to the issues that were discussed in your explicit lesson. Uh, and with your group that has already been assigned, you're going to come up with a um, product, let's say, um, that's a poster that highlights nine different diamonds, okay? Or uh, you can call this a, a kite, okay? that focuses on one solution and it should be no more than three words maximum, okay? Be creative. You don't have to follow the one in the book precisely. You can represent your creativity by providing a different example perhaps, all right? So this week is going to be sim uh, very simple. We're going to mostly do explicits and finally a creation of the solutions. Now, although you may think that these are explicits and they're not really related to our unit, but you're wrong. This is taken from the book exactly from our unit. And this is very, very important for criterion A, your E2 assessment.